Hi, I'm Juliet, and I work with FutureFit as a tutor and an assessor, and I've also been running my own Pilates business for 20 years. On your intermediate Pilates course, we'll be covering the rest of the exercises that you haven't yet done after your basic. We'll discuss the closing phase and the different types of stretches. And we'll also discuss in detail your 12-week plan, how to put it together and what to expect on your assessment day and cover all the questions that you may have around your assessment and how to complete your portfolio. My name's Emma and I'm studying the Level 3 Intermediate Mat-Based Pilates course. The course is going great today, I'm really enjoying it and it's great to be improving my confidence with teaching, getting to learn a little bit more about what the exercises are doing for the body, how to teach them correctly, how to adapt them for different client base and meeting other people as well. I'm finding the blended learning works really well for me as an individual. I've got a young family and a very busy fitness business already, so it means that I can teach in my own time, learn in my own time. The app is really useful, so sometimes I'm just in my car between clients and I can quickly do a bit of learning whilst out and about. So it works really, really well for me being able to learn when it suits me. Um, I'm really enjoying the fact that there's some practical days as well. I've done courses in the past which are solely online and it becomes a bit sterile. It's nice to come in and actually meet people, talk over things, find out what other people are doing with their businesses and their learning as well. So face-to-face -face interaction is really important and I'm really enjoying it. Okay, I chose FutureFit um, for a few different reasons, really. The customer service was great when I called and wanted to learn a little bit more about what the course involved, how it was taught. I got really good um, service from customer service, which was good. And location-wise, there's lots of different venues that could have typically suited where I am. Um, so that was really good. And also some other Pilates courses that are out there, you need to um, shadow somebody for a, a lot of time. And for me, with my busy life, that just wouldn't work. And also, I think I would always question whether the person I shadow was shadowing was teaching correctly. So I like learning from tutors and teachers so I know what I'm doing is correct. So that was really important to me. If somebody was on the fence um, about signing up for a course, I'd say go for it. It's worked really well for me so far. Um, I'm looking forward to getting my assessment done, feeling confident about doing my assessment. I think the support has been great. There's support from the office if you need it. And the content is easy to manage and learn. And yeah, I'm finding it really good. On your intermediate workshop, we recommend that you download your manual onto a tablet or similar and bring a notebook and pen as you'll be making notes throughout the day. Bring your own mat with you, and if you need a block, we suggest you bring one with you too. Please make sure you've completed all your e-learning prior to the course, and bring with you the two completed session plans that you were set as homework after your basic workshop day. If you have any questions about your learning journey, don't hesitate to get in touch with us using the details below, and we really hope you enjoy your workshops.